Yo, what up? It is the 16th of July, 2024. It is currently 8.40 p.m. on a Tuesday. And we got a lucky rainy day again. We're uh, just about really, I suppose, over halfway through um, uh, July now. So you would expect the dry season to actually have started up by now, but I guess uh, we've still got a little bit more rain coming. We'll see how much longer this lasts. This might be the last time it rains, but I feel like I have said that before, so I guess we won't, uh, I won't, um, I won't try and call it because I don't seem to, you know, have a good grasp of it, I guess. Um, well, let's talk to everyone because we don't really have much else to do today. According to the letter I got from the Happy Room Academy, my room's a mess. I can't believe that coordination owed me 262 points. I guess cutting edge style always takes a while to catch on. I know I'm being judged, but I can't help but laugh. Like a maniac. A hoo hoo hoo. That's how he's laughing there. A huh. Well, he's saying a huh. Oh, the samurai suit. Oh, what the? Hmm, let's see, let's see. Samurai suit. Oh, no, I already have the samurai suit. I've actually only got a couple of spotlight items left. I need the Arwing, the dolly, the fine painting, the lovely kitchen, the ranch hutch, the throne, and the white queen. The samurai suit is not one of those things. So, yeah, it looks like I, uh, I need to go to Nooks today. Although I will because I need to sell all of the stuff that I haven't been selling for the past couple days. Hello Antonio, we're breaking order a little bit. Oh, Buck's up there too, I guess we, he's not trying to move out today. Something's bugging Blathers an awful lot, I, can't, I can tell. It's pretty hard to be the firstborn son, you know. Not that I'd know. Because he is the firstborn son. Does firstborn son mean specifically you're the first son to be born? Like, as in, you're the first son as opposed to daughter? I guess so. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, aren't you looking a little haggard? Have I told you nothing? Your health starts in your abs. Pretty off to me. My abs rock my stomach. My stomach rocks my brain. My brain rocks the house. Did you get all that? Good, because abs are a way of life. Good to know, I guess. This is, a. Uh, I I love this track. Da, 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 yeah. Da, 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 da. <sighs> What's wrong? Ah, yes, who? I was merely reminiscing again. Tell me. Suppose I was still at university then, indeed. I was on summer holiday. Yes, who? As I recall, I was about to start my new part-time job. You see, there was a bit of a mold problem with the library's books, what? So it was my duty to lay them out on the windowsill to dry in the sunlight. Who? The horror of it all. It was on the job that I made a grievous error. What'd you do? Who very well. There are various specialized books in the university library. Not to mention the reference books that rare, rarely get read, eh, what? These books tend to get eaten by book lice and the like, you see. Now bear in mind, I loathe insects. I was holding a book by a page's corner, but the weight of the tome proved too portly for the poor page. RIP! I looked up, aghast, and the librarian's eyes were on me. Such shame, such shame. I must say, I rather think the episode served to... Well, I believe it exacerbated my fear of creepy crawlies, who... Sucks. I did not know that there were book lice. I guess I gotta check all my books. <laughs> I Yeah, I didn't know that such a thing existed. Why would, bu why would bugs want to eat books? I mean, they I guess they're, you know, like wood if you really get down to it. But they don't know what a book is, or like paper. Unless they evolved to know that, but evol evolution takes a while. Hey boss, I'm gonna tell you something. I've seen him. Right here. Really? <laughs> boss, ignorance is bliss. You're sharing a house with them too. You probably have a million crawly roommates. You just don't know because they come out when you sound asleep. A lot of bug talk today. It's a buggy episode. I've already uh, had my episode of bug- That sounds like, like a manic episode. Like a, um bug-scented episode where I talked about how I treat bugs. Uh, so I'm not going to talk about bugs anymore. <laughs> All that to say.
Well, what does Tangy? I mean, Tangy wouldn't like bugs very much, I guess. Hi, Smokey. I'm wondering, what size of house do you prefer? A big one. Now listen, just big isn't good enough. Unless you're talking about a heart, those are always better bigger. I just said something so deep. Quick, write that down. Nope. I am recording it though, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> saved somewhere, in some capacity. And yeah, I guess I could use this to really log any information. I mean, I guess I already have been doing that for like 197 days of the, out of the year. And yes, I know, I now know the episode number. So today is uh, uh, episode 198. So I guess whatever day it is, it's like two in front is the final digit. Please don't pay attention to how I arrange my furniture. It's embarrassing. Not at all. Yes, to tell you the truth, I worked hard to design my room. I could tell. What with the uh, lack of, general lack of furniture. It takes a lot of uh, scrutiny to remove so much from your house. <laughs> I could never, personally. I do have a problem with, like, uh, being very selective, well, not selective, but just attached, I guess, to, like, items and just in general, like, keeping things, I guess. I mean, hell, I, in this game, I make that pretty clear with how often I don't want people to leave the town. I've got a job for you. You're gonna deliver this letter to Hugh ASAP. I have some leeway, so if you can do it within one hour, it's all good. Okay, sure. What was it recently, though, that I was having trouble getting rid of stuff? I can't remember what it was. But yeah, just but and just in general, I mean, I'm always bad at uh, throwing stuff away. I definitely have like a a like what if I need this later policy. <laughs> Here you go, Hugh. From Pango, I wonder what the letter says. Well, that clears things up. Wanna see it? I think I can show you Pango's secret. Hi, Hugh. Your letter totally rocked my world. Thanks. Samba symbolizes all that is my youth. The It Girl, Pango. I don't know what that means. Ha 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 ha. Letters really soothe the heart almost as much as pizza. Give my regards to Pango. Mmm, pizza. You know, I would, uh... Pizza's really good, huh? <laughs> I don't- I, I had a pizza yesterday, so I was gonna because I, I was gonna say, like, no, I don't feel like a pizza, because I just had one the other day. I mean, yeah, pizza's good. But I feel like I've, uh... not grown out of it. No, I definitely have not grown out of pizza, but, uh... Like, I don't know. I guess, uh, yeah, I feel like when you're a kid, you never, like, crave, like, vegetables, or at least I never did. I just had them. I never complained about them, though. I was usually pretty, like, quick, well, not quick to eat them, but, I, you know, I'd have them. But I feel like now, you know, I definitely will get, like, I'll feel like vegetables by the time dinner comes around. And I, th I mean, I think that's good. I don't need any of this stuff. Come on. When's the last time I got a new item? It was probably, it was probably a couple days ago. <laughs> I mean, you know, getting down to it now, we're 90% of the way through all the items, it's going to be very uncommon to see a new item uh, for the foreseeable future. But they can show up at any time, so... Uh, oh wait, no, 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 don't get rid of that, I need- the, the mermaid statue is a golfer item. Plus the wall, then get rid of this, uh, sleep line, the panel, okay, these things I'm keeping. I guess I took the mermaid statue away the other day, I, I'll put that away in my, in, the, in my storage. <sighs> well, is that gonna about wrap it, wrap it up for today? Did I talk to- I, did, I guess I did talk to everyone already, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Hmm. Well, I'm just gonna look around to see if there's any weeds anywhere. Man, I didn't even have a 
overarching theme for this episode to make into a title. I mean, coming up with the titles is a surprisingly strenuous process for me. <laughs> I, I always make, like, usually I'll make it a point that, because the way my, I guess I haven't explained this, but the way my system works for uploading is I record all these on my phone. I upload them to YouTube from the YouTube app. Uh, and then once they're on uploaded, I go on my computer and edit all of the stuff like the thumbnail and the d title and description and stuff. Uh, because I just find it easier. I don't really like navigating stuff on a phone and I'm just better with a computer. But, um, uh, with the titles, I would usually make it an effort to try and find something in the video and then put the title in when it uploads initially. I sc I'll have it, like, privated, obviously, so that's why the videos come out at around the same time every day, because it's scheduled to come out on, at 8 p.m. Um, 8 p.m. in my area. But yeah, um... Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, I'll make it a point to usually try and, like, come up with a title when I initially upload it from my phone, because then by the time I get around to adding the information, uh, in the computer, uh, I'll forget what the episode was about. <laughs> Sometimes I'll literally forget that I ever played on certain days, just because... Man, I feel like this episode's been too short. Was that okay? I, I feel like... Okay, I definitely talked to everyone, right? I talked to Tangy, Pang, Pangy, uh, Marina, Peewee, Hugh, Cube, Antonio... Excuse me, and Buck. Yeah, I talked to everyone. And Blathers, too. Yeah, I guess that is going to be it for today. Yeah. Well, maybe tomorrow, well, tomorrow, well, I guess we'll see if it rains again, and if not, then I guess we'll have a bit of a longer one, because I'll have to water all the flowers. Yeah, that's, uh, gonna be it for today.